is uh, I wet I wet girls. <laughs> We're gonna do a tutorial today about uh, filling up your little skill bars. I'm gonna use this character for today. Let's see. Uh, let me just get in the car and start it up. Uh, okay, what you wanna do is to fill up your little skill bar. Let me show you the skill bar right there. Your status. Those are your skills right there. St we're talking about the skill bars, not nothing else, okay? As you can see, the stamina is almost filled up. Chewing is halfway. Strength is very low. Stealth is very low. Flying is low. Driving is almost full. Lung capacity is rarely there. We're gonna try to fill up those little bars. Most of the time, you you uh, might know how to do some of them, not all of them. So I'm gonna show you how to do all of them. Like to fill up those little, um, um, let's say uh, diving or um, lung capacity. Um, you can do it right here on regular session or an invite session like I am right now. But since I'm gonna fill up other bars at the same time, I'm gonna go in a, on a mission I'll press jobs play jobs rockstar created then we go to missions then uh, you can choose a, any Gerald's mission that won't get the cops on you or you can go to this one that I usually go to which is called repossession um, what is it called repossession RV nearly there. Repo RV nearly there. It's actually repossession, but they just put repo. Okay, so we're gonna start there. Well, you can put it on easy if you want to. You're just gonna fill up the little bars and at the end we'll do the mission just to get paid you know so you don't waste your time I don't like to waste my time when I'm filling up the bar that's why I tell you that um, you can do it on a regular session or on an invite session but you won't get paid if you're swimming and you're filling up those little bars or you're trying to let's say uh, fill up your stamina bar or swimming bar or something like that at the end, you're just gonna be tired, and uh, you're not gonna fill up those little bars. Right now, I'm gonna show you how to get paid and how to fill up the bars at the same time. There's a lot of tutorials, you know, that everybody does, but um, I like to get paid for everything, you know. I don't want to waste my time running for nothing and doing this for nothing. Or so I'm gonna go over here first. Um, I'm gonna fill up the little bars for um, swimming or lung capacity. I'm just gonna fill one little bar, okay? Because you can't be doing this all day, you get tired of it. Especially when you're trying to fill up just one bar. You get tired, really. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> anyway, look up. You can uh, start swimming over the water like this. That'll fill your stamina bar. You can also swim under the water like this. That'll fill up your stamina bar. And that'll also fill up the, the lung capacity. Uh, but you have to come up every time the little bar flashes right there on your left hand corner at the bottom when it starts flashing you gotta get out or else you're gonna drown so this is the way you fill up two bars up with one one action 
when the air starts flashing you gotta get out or else you're gonna drown and just spawn on top of the beach no biggie that's all you do but see I don't want to fill up my stamina bar so what I'm gonna do is just go underwater until my little uh, long capacity bar starts flashing right there on the screen be there now we go out of the water now we try it again see when you go out, up on the water you just get some air and go back in there just a little bit of air and over time the air gets higher and higher here comes the boat trying to run me over that's all I needed So the more you do this, uh, the more uh, lung capacity you get. So you can withstand a uh, longer time under the water. Like if you're searching for something at the ground here, you're trying to get something, you won't drown right away. You can take your time. Yeah, because uh, once you go to the um, middle of the ocean back there, where it's deep, if you tr just try to go down, straight down, you'll probably run out of air and you won't make it up once you start going down. Because it's too deep. That's why you have to fill up your lung capacity. Like, let, let's suppose you're like swimming like me right there with your clothes on and stuff. You got your little car over there on the dock or somewhere close to the road. And let's say you drop your keys in the water. And then you go down there and try to get them. <laughs> you can get them if your lung capacity is high. But if you're in the ocean, man, you're just going to drown. You won't be able to get them. Anyway, you keep on doing this till the, the little bar that's moving at the bottom uh, left hand corner starts slowing down and you'll see that uh, you're taking longer and longer under the water. In other words, your lung capacity is getting bigger. Is that a starfish? Yeah, a starfish. That's the first. Anyway, if you take too long, as you can see, I'm losing my health. My little bar, green bar, is um, being depleted because I'm taking too long. And if it gets all the way down, you just die as soon as it finishes. Mm. You can take some snacks, you know, to fix it up, but I, I don't like to take snacks. I'd rather just die. Actually, um, when I have a little character that I create on GTA, by the time they're level 34 or 36, all my little bars are filled up. Uh, on this character, I haven't messed with it because um, I've been doing too many heists and stuff. See? So all the little bars are not filled up. They should be, but they're not. Because I never had the time to fill them up since I use different characters. In this account, I hardly ever use it. So yesterday, I think I did a tutorial on how to do the Kayo setups. Today, I'm going to do a tutorial how to fill up those little bars. And after I do this, I'm going to stop recording. And uh, probably later on tonight, I'll play with my friends on GTA and record it. 
Yesterday uh, I was playing with my friends, but um, <laughs> they decided to go away from Mahaj after I did Mahaj and go to do survival. See, the thing is, uh, I don't like survival. You have to do survival, but I don't like it. But my friends do. I just do it once a day, survival, just to fill up the bars again. You know, it fills up your little bars. But I don't like survival, but my friends do. Not all of them, but some of them do. Anyway, some of the time you get paid uh, sometimes two times and three times the RPs. When uh, Rockstar decides to put them on special, you know, those games on special, so you get double the RPs, double the money and stuff like that. But today, uh, they're not doing that. They got something else on special. It's just like when you go to your bushers, they give you a special. And what is it, lamb chops? And you get them lamb chops, you buy some lamb chops. Then you find out those lamb chops are um, two or three days old. <laughs> That's why they give us the special, because nobody wants to do it. <laughs> Let me see if I can take a dive. Yeah, <laughs> just like in the movies. <laughs> uh, to take a dive like that, you just press uh, L1 and X at the same time. And that's the same thing I do when I um, swim underwater. When I'm on top of the water, I press L1 and X to go underwater. Anyway, it does take a little while, that's why I'm telling you that um, I'm just gonna fill up one little bar because it takes too long. Man, can you imagine if I fill up all those little bars just today while you're watching? You, uh, you would probably get too tired of watching this. I get tired of doing it and you get tired of watching it. <laughs> but you have to do it. Or else your little character won't have those little bars filled up. Anyway, the advantage of having those little bars filled up is that um, once you you can dive uh, all the way down under the water like this. Like let's say a gamer is trying to kill you and they get a little knife and they try to come after you and his little bars are not filled up but yours are. He'll probably drown before he gets to you. Plus, you can get up to the other side swimming like this, and he won't be able to. If he goes underwater, he's just gonna die. Mm. And also, the other bars, like let's say uh, driving, if you don't fill up those little bars, they, they won't let you win a race. The game will mess you up on person. Um, person. Uh, they'll just make you crash or put an obstacle in front of you. You have to f fill up the bars. If you don't fill up the bars, even though you're a good driver, the, the game will make you crash or slide and just waste your time. And also the um, the strength bar. The strength bar, you gotta fill them up. If you don't fill them up, anybody on GTA that has their little bars filled up and you don't, they're just gonna smack you one time and kill you with one smack. And also the stamina bar, um, 
You get it, like I told you, from swimming uh, over, under the water, or running. Or you can use a bike, whatever you like. And that's how you fill them up. But the problem is, um, if you don't fill them up, um, somebody could run after you, catch up to you, and kill you. If you fill them up, you can, uh, there you go. My little bar is filled up, one of the bars, okay? Tells you on the screen when the, the bars are filled up. Let's see, we go to status, skills, see? One of the bars, long capacity is filled up. So now we're gonna fill up the um, stealth and the, um, and the strength. Let's see. So you can take as long as you want to on this uh, mission. There's no time limit. They won't kick you off as long as you're moving your little uh, character or driving around. You can stay here forever and also you can blow up cars, kill AI so you won't get the cops on you. You can stay here making a lot of money if you're really uh, low ranking and you just want to kill those AIs because they got in your way yesterday and today. <laughs> you can kill them today <laughs> instead of yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going right here to the bank. The bank is straight ahead. You can choose any place you like, like the park, one of the parks, or a certain street that you like. You're more familiar with it. I like to choose the bank because uh, the bank has a lot of people spawning all the time outside of it. Uh, as you will see, it's the people spawn there all the time. Hey, and you just park your car any, any place you like. I like to park it over here. And I'm gonna drink a Coke to fill up my little health bar. You will see on the left hand corner at the bottom it'll fill up with one coke. <coughs> okay, so now my health is full. Now what you need to do is go to the gun shop and buy yourself a little knife like this one. Or uh, this one is a, it's called a switchblade knife. You press R1 and it come out you can put it in and also if you, g you get a dagger you can do the same thing anyway what you do is press L1 then press um, R3 to hunch, hunch down like this and then move move closer and then you're gonna press one R1 keep it pressed down and then when you get close to the subject like I have it pressed down right now you press zero like that remember you have to do all of that then you press R3 to get this little character up. Anyway, that was the stealth. Then we put the knife away. Now we're just gonna run around like this. I'll be smacking people like this. You don't have to kill him, just smack him one time. Anyway, that's all you have to do. So you see that little bar peeling up, which is the um, strike bar. 
This is for strength. To develop your little muscle. Anyway, I never did develop um, my little bar for picking up girls. <laughs> Not even in real life, every time I pick up a girl I just fall over. <laughs> They're too heavy. Anyway, it, it looks awful, you know, this looks awful. When I first did this, I, I said to myself, man, this looks bad. <laughs> but GTA, uh, the game, you know, is the one that decides what you're supposed to do and the rules. And you're supposed to do this to fill up your little bars. I personally don't like to see this, you know, ladies getting beat up and stuff. Because ladies always complain, you know, that men in real life, they abuse ladies, which is true. So you don't want to see this stuff, but the thing is, it's part of the game. Anyway, ladies don't like to get abused by men. So when they join GTA, they abuse guys. You get too tired, just take a little break. Slow it down. So you do get tired, you know, with your little finger pressing a button and just move it back and forth. Anyway, once you hit all these uh, little AIs, you go back and try to go over the dead bodies. Some of them are dead, some of them are not. What you whacking into me for? And uh, you just pick up the money. Anyway, this is for um, stealth. If you're too close to a, a wall, they won't let you do the stealth. Anyway. <laughs> oh boy. Oy. Let me drink some coffee. Anyway, in most of the accounts I have, I have a girl character and a guy character. And most of the time I like to use the girl character, you know, because I like girls. Anyway, today I'm using the boy or the man. Let's see.
Sometimes you'll be laughing and laughing doing this. Because every time you smack somebody, they go, ooh, uh. And sometimes you hear a girl, he says, oi. <laughs> like a guy. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's, let's go back. Takes a little while to fill up both bar. Uh, takes about five minutes or six minutes. You gotta do it like this non stop. And that's why I like to come here because the little AIs they keep on spawning. So once you go around the corner, you'll see there's more AI spawn. Gotta get this money. Sometimes you make over a thousand dollars just filling up one little box. Plus uh, the mission that you're gonna do, so you get a, a lot of money doing this. The stealth bar gets filled up faster than the power bar.
<laughs> Facial effects. There it is. One bar shield up. With a stamina bar. Hello, blind eye. Ah. Holy fucking god! Anyway, this is for the stealth. Strength is filled up. So I'm gonna go finish the mission and move on to something else. This is for the stealth, remember? $1,269 Do this, doing this This is going to be a part from the mission that we're going to do right now Let me just check my weapons um, I don't have too many weapons Okay, let's go over there and do the mission. Anyway, this happens all the time. The AI is getting in your way on purpose.
get it. I'll use this one. to do is wait for Uncle Faster to come over here and try to kill me. You see him across the street? He's running over here. He's looking for me. See, the reason we have to wait for Uncle Faster and, and kill him over here, this is to allow time for the, all those uh, mobile homes that I blew up to disappear, or else I'm going to have to move the debris. Once he gets here, you can kill him and by that time, all the debris over there at the yard is going to be gone. By the time we get over there, all the debris that I blew up, it's going to be gone. So all I have to do is drive the truck out of there. But first I might have to kill one or two enemies left over. Well, this time there's no enemies at all. Gotta pick up this dollar bill right here. Oh, well, that's it. See, there's no debris. So the brigade is have has half um, life left on the health bar. Look at this. This hardly ever happens. It lost control on purpose. this and make you go out of control on purpose waste your time and if the game wants you uh, to blow up your truck they can blow up your truck you can't do nothing about it
<laughs> to play I saw it getting in the way. Anyway, as you can see you get some RPs doing missions so your rank starts going up. If you wanna keep on doing this you can go ahead. I'm not gonna do it though. <laughs> gonna be doing the tutorial and next I'm gonna join um, let's see survival I hate survival but I, I know how to do it I've been doing it for years the reason I don't like survival is just like the missions you know the game sheets then sometimes take away your weapon from your hands or they suddenly spawn enemies on your back or on your side and kill you. That's why I don't like survival. Anyway, let's see. I'm gonna get a little bulletproof vest here. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna show you how to save money. So you have to buy one more bulletproof vest, but um, instead of uh, buying one, I'm just gonna show you how to get one for free. So on this little character I only use uh, three bullet per vest, so we're gonna, we're gonna get one for free. Let's see. Let's go to our regular station to see if uh, somebody helps me with survival. You can, do, uh, you can do it yourself, but it gets boring playing by yourself. So we're gonna go to um, our regular session. Okay, hi. Um, let's see, we're gonna join friends. <coughs> oh, I forgot to put myself on a party, shall we? Sometimes they lie to you, sometimes they tell you the truth. But most of the time they lie to you. Let me go get some coffee and I'll be right back. Okay, this is a small session, but it's good enough. It's a regular session. Let me put this money in the bank and we'll get to it. Anyway, let me see who's on the session. Look at my KD, 3.21. And this one is level 213, his KD is only 0 0.62. And the other one left too. Anyway, they're leaving because uh, I just came in the session and they're afraid. Of so I'm just gonna do one, let's see, another one came in. I'm gonna join uh, another session with more players. As you can see, the other one looks like he's a modder or something. Cause I can't even see him on the map here. 
you see that? I only see this one. This other one is level 300. So he must be a mod or something. Anyway, we don't really care what he is or what he does. We're gonna go to another session. Well, there's more players. This one, there's a couple of uh, people. Man, I don't know what happened. There's not too many people on GTA today. This is a guy, I, I think he's a Chinese guy. Anyway, it doesn't matter. He just created this little character, as you can see. He's just trying to make some money on GTA. I can tell it's a guy by the name. Yeah, he's Chinese from China. I already checked the profile. Anyway, let's move on to another uh, session. Because there are very few pl players on this session. This one looks like a full session, 29 public players, let's see. I'm just looking around to see what kind of player they are. 66, level 193, 118, 176. 249, 34, 62, 20, 43, just ended up here today. They probably started their little account um, today or yesterday. <coughs> Let's see. Okay, that's good enough. On 
this one had the, the, the level 4 had money. He invested some money in the game. I could tell because he bought a helicopter. On level 4 you don't have any money to buy a helicopter. That's very bad when you have to buy anything from uh, Rockstar Games with your own money. They just rip, uh, rip you off. Uh, anyway, let's get started. Let's see, I'm gonna go home. Oh, I forgot. I'm registered, uh, registered as a VIP. Tire. You always want to put yourself on disabled mode unless you want to kill players and stuff. On a regular session, I don't. Anyway, let me start it. Jobs. Play. Rocks are created. Survival. I look for something easy. Processing plant. Look at this 1000 level with 1.54 KD. <laughs> He's on training wheels. <laughs> anyway. Let's get to the job at hand. Okay, so we're just gonna go. Try to get whatever we need. I'm gonna blow this one up. Right there to move the van. And try to get this one. Look at this, it didn't blow the, the thing up. Man, I'm telling you, this game cheats a lot. So I have to watch myself because I don't have too many bullet problems and uh, I'm a low ranking player. I die quickly because my bars are not filled up. So I let the heroes be heroes. But I'll try to stand, stay alive to the end. And every time you try to get weapons, because I don't have too many weapons either. There's some weapons here. Some weapons here. And that's it, that's all I could get. Let's see if I can use the weapon they gave me. Oh man. This one. It's like a little AK-47. Oh man. One of the players left. Take cover. Oh, God. It's 
sound like a little typewriter. <laughs> I remember a long time ago, when I was younger, my mother bought my sister a typewriter. Not that I'm talking about typewriters. So I said, what the hell, what is this thing doing here in the house? So I took a look at it and I told my sister, well, well, why is my mother buying this typewriter stuff? Just because I want to be a secretary and this and that. And I said, man. So boring being behind the desk all the time. Just typing and typing and writing, taking messages and stuff. She says, no, I like it, you know. Okay. So uh, I started messing with the typewriter when my sister wasn't home. And you know what? I started liking the typewriter. I started writing little stories and little messages and all kinds of stuff. Make believe stories. I liked it so much that my mother paid for some lessons for me, me and my sister. So me and my sister went to <coughs> to music school, a, a special class they have, where where uh, there's a, a bunch of students learning to play uh, piano and learning how to play, uh, write and play music and stuff like that. Gonna say what's all with this player, you know? 
He's a low ranking player, he's killing a lot of the a lot of enemies. Get over here. to get the big gun. Oh. Should be over here. Ah oh, man. I thought it was a big gun. This uh, give me some. What the hell? Ha ha ha. gonna kill me.
They put it right there on the fire. Man. And look, they put this truck also. Right there. Look at this. They did it on purpose just so I can get killed. Body of my... oh. He was sending me a message, but it's not there no more. I don't know why he wanted it.
Come on, man. I don't know why they make my little character get stuck. This guy's not doing nothing.
Look at this, they wouldn't die. They just shot me. See what I mean? They gave me all the sheets. Let's see if we can get a little doll over here. There it is. What the hell did it disappear? You saw it? It was right there. And then it disappeared as soon as I got close. What the hell? I don't know what 
the, the game is uh, cheating or something. Let's see, let me come back. No, it's still not there. I don't know what happened. See, the game always cheats. I was going to get a dawn and it disappeared. Look at this. for the eyes.
Look at this car coming through the alleyway. <laughs> I can't pick up any bulletproof vest or nothing. Guy oh no, how many times in one month? Oh boy, this guy is holding up the store. Oh. It's where? Oh, he's a friend of mine. I don't know why he's following me. <laughs> they put AIs in here way on purpose. <laughs> Another AI, look at this. get anything damn it I'm just gonna leave that's why I don't like this stupid stations
guy. Anyway, that's that's gonna end the tutorial, kids. I uh, for the um, upgrading your skills. I'm just gonna go play regular sessions. I mean, I uh, invite sessions and uh, help players. I might start recording later on. Thank you for watching.